Hi guys, today I'm gonna review one of my uh, favorite books, Diary of Ruby Kid Dog Days. So this is the fourth book in the Wimpy Kids seri series. And this is the front. And there's the back. And I am going to read you guys the front of the book. June, Friday, for me, summer vacation is basically a three month guilt trip. Just because the weather is nice. Everyone expects you to be outside all day, frolicking or whatever. And if you don't spend every day sucking outdoors, people will think there's something wrong with you. But the truth is, I always been more of an indoor person. The way I spend my summer vacation is in front of the TV playing video games with the, the curtains closed and the lights turned off. See? That's the plot. I'm just going to read you one more page. Unfortunately, Mom's idea of a perfect summer vacation is different from mine. Mom says it's not natural for a kid to stay indoors when it's sunny out, and I told her I'm just trying to protect my skin. I don't look good all the wrinkly when I'm old like her. But she doesn't want to hear it. Mom keeps trying to get me to do something outside, like to go to the pool, but I spend the first part of the summer at my friend Riley's, Riley's pool, and that doesn't work out so good. Riley's family belongs to a country club, and when school is out for the summer, we are going every day. We're going there every single day, and then then we made a mistake. I can find this girl named uh, Trisha who has just moved into our neighborhood. I thought it would be really nice of us to share our country club lifestyle with her, but five seconds after we go go, go got to the pool. She met some lifeguard and forgot all about the guys who invited her there. And that's like the other one. It's summer vacation and the weather is great and all the kids are having fun outside. So it's going carefully inside his house, playing video games with the sister John. Greg is so confused, an indoor person, and living out his ultimate summer fantasy. No responsibilities and no rules. But Greg's mom has a different vision of an ideal summer, one practice outdoor activities, and family togetherness. Whose vision will win out, or will a new addition to the happy family will change everything? See, that's the back, and that's the front. It says the, the New York Times bestseller. So go read Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Old School. No, I mean, Dog Days. Sorry about that. So go read Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Dog Days.